in its quest towards improving the ease of doing business in Ogun State. The Ministry of Agriculture says it has partnered with financial institutions to train no fewer than 100 women and youths in a bid for them to have access to all forms of funding. Senior Special Assistant to the State Governor on Agriculture, Dr. Angel Adela Jacque, stated this at the Open State Access to Agricultural Finance Seminar held in Abelkuta, the state capital. Details in this report. Dr. Adela Jakuye noted that the goal of the state government is to empower youths into various sectors of the state economy, with agriculture as the major factor towards job creation. She added that the outcome of the training is geared toward ensuring youth and women are investment ready, among others. So this program is for access to agricultural finance for both youth as well as women. It's to give them a leg up and to be able to connect them to where the money is when it comes to getting access to loans, getting access to grants, getting access to investment for their agribusinesses. And it's also to make sure that they are investment ready. Many times they know how to run their business, but to package their business in such a way where somebody can also put funds into it becomes difficult. So after this four-day training, um, they'll be able to, they will go through an enterprise development training and they'll actually learn how to um, put their business plan together, put their financials together, pitch their business, make sure they know how to market and scale and grow very efficient agribusinesses. On how the beneficiaries were selected, Dr. Adela Jakuya said they were picked from the Ogun State Job Portal as part of the current administration's efforts to reduce unemployment. She said that the initiative behind the program was to boost agricultural productivity, agribusiness capacity and the entire gross domestic product, GDP, of the state. The job portal has been very instrumental for the Ministry of Agriculture when it comes to recruitment of new youth into agriculture. We already have great rapport with our farmers. We know where their, their associations are, we know where to find them. But for the youth to see agriculture as something attractive, we, we make sure that from our programs, they see what the opportunities are, and you notice that they will always log in to the job portal to look for agric opportunities. And so we leverage on the job portal, as well as agribusinesses who are known to the ministry, that are young people doing amazing things, and we invited them for the program. So these 100 youth are just the first phase. We want to make sure that we handhold them through the process. We'll also be following up with them to make sure that all of them get access to the funds that they're looking for, and then the next batch as well. So. Some of the beneficiaries thank the state government for the gesture. They say it will further enhance their productivity level in the agribusiness sector. I want to be able to get help in terms of what are the right things to do. I know that there is a right way of doing things to be able to get help. So I want to get the necessary information, go back to the drawing board and be able to use that information to improve my business. Then we can see that most of us, as we have actually put in for different kind of grants, and it's not coming in, and different loan like national loan. I personally have put in for it, but I was denied. I couldn't. I couldn't say this is the reason why that happened. So the main reason why we are here now is to teach us step by step how to get the loan. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.